The First Sacred War, or Syrian War, was fought between the Amphictyonic League of Delphi and the city of Kira. At the beginning of the 6th century BC the Paleo-Delphic Amphictyony, controlled by the Thessalians, attempted to take hold of the sacred land of Apollo which resulted in this war. The conflict arose due to Kira's frequent robbery and mistreatment of pilgrims going to Delphi and their encroachments upon Delphic land. The war, which culminated with the defeat and destruction of Kira, is notable for the use of chemical warfare at the siege of Kira, in the form of hellebore being used to poison the city's water supply. The war's end was marked by the organization of the first Pythian Games. Chapter 1, Siege of Kira The leader of the attack was the tyrant Cleisthenes of Sicyon, who used his powerful navy to blockade the city's port before using an allied Amphictyonic army to besiege Kira. The Athenians also participated with a contingent led by Alcmion. On the Thessalian side, the leaders were Eurylochos and Hippias. What transpired after this is a matter of debate, the earliest, and therefore probably most reliable, account is that of the medical writer Thessalos. He wrote, in the 5th century BC, that the attackers discovered a secret water pipe leading into the city after it was broken by a horse's hoof. An Asulpiad named Nebros advised the allies to poison the water with hellebore which soon rendered the defenders so weak with diarrhea that they were unable to resist the assault. Kira was captured and the entire population was slaughtered. Nebros was considered an ancestor of Hippocrates, so this story has caused many to wonder whether it might not have been guilt over his ancestors' use of poison that drove Hippocrates to establish the Hippocratic Oath. Later historians told different stories. According to Frontinus, who wrote in the 1st century AD, after discovering the pipe, the Amphictyonic League cut it, leading to great thirst within the city. They then restored the pipe and the desperate Kirans immediately began drinking the water, unaware that Cleisthenes had poisoned it with hellebore. According to Polyanus, a writer of the 2nd century the attackers added the hellebore to the spring from which the water came. Polyanus also gave credit for the strategy not to Cleisthenes but to General Eurylochus, who he claimed advised his allies to gather a large amount of hellebore from Antisyra, where it was abundant. The stories of Frontinus and Polyanus both have the same result as Thessalos's tale, the defeat of Kira. The last major historian to advance a new story of the siege was Pausanias, who was active in the 2nd century. In his version of events, Solon of Athens diverted the course of the river Pleistos to avoid through Kira, but the enemy was able to get enough water from their wells and rainwater collection. Solon then added a great quantity of hellebore to the water of the Pleistos and let it flow into Kira. Chapter 2 Outcome of the War the First Sacred War ended with the victory of the allies of the Amphictyony. Kira was destroyed and its lands were dedicated to Apollo, Leto and Artemis and it was forbidden to cultivate them or let animals graze on them. Its inhabitants fled to mountain Kerfi. Cleisthenes was generously rewarded with one-third of the booty. In order to celebrate the end of the fighting the first Pythian games were organized with Cleisthenes playing a major part in them. However, modern scholarship is very skeptical on the exact events and on the long duration of the war.